Some researchers propose that a large iron asteroid might have grazed the atmosphere and partially skipped back into space, but this scenario remains speculative. Regardless of the exact type, the evidence increasingly pointed to a cosmic origin and a high altitude detonation as the explanation for the unprecedented destruction. By the mid 20th century, the Tunguska event had become a benchmark for understanding atmospheric explosions of cosmic objects. Scientists recognized that such air bursts could cause massive regional damage without leaving conventional impact evidence. The mystery of the, the, the missing crater, once baffling Kulik, was now explained by a combination of velocity, altitude, and the object's explosive disintegration in the sky. Yet even with this mainstream explanation, the event retained an aura of the strange and inexplicable, a reminder that nature could unleash incomprehensible power far above the ground, leaving almost no trace of the weapon that had done it. The Tunguska event also prompted renewed interest in planetary defense. By studying past air bursts and near-Earth objects, scientists began to understand the potential threat such events pose to populated areas. Today, Tunguska serves as both a historical oddity and a cautionary tale. A cosmic event capable of leveling vast tracts of forest, demonstrating the fine line between natural wonder and catastrophic destruction.